Hey, how's it going everyone? Today I am going to show you something insane on Fallout 76 that I'm sure not a lot of you know about. The title itself, you get the basics of what it is, but once we show up here and we look to the right, where the heck is the new silo doors? And I'm going to explain how this is possible. But I'm going to just give you the quick tour and how intense this is because you're, I mean, if you're like me, you're going to run through this and be like, what the hell is going on here? Because every door is removed. It's gone. It's poof. No more. You will be able to go through the new silo incredibly fast with the method that I'm going to show you here in a second. As you're watching right now, every door that I've walked through, including the laser grid before, is pretty much gone or it's not pretty much gone it is gone it's it's not there anymore it does not exist in this world and here we are we have finally reached the end of the nuke silo there is the assaultron and then we have the turrets up above and to the left of course and uh two at top and the one on the right anywho you're in this area and you can go to the terminal activate the nuke silo steps you know the whole quest so that you can go through this and it's done that's all you have to do it's better than anything that's out there currently, including the glitches, but of course there are some sort of restrictions to this. And first and foremost, that is going to be, da 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 da, yeah, it's for PC. Most of you that are on console are going to be like, oh, okay, here we go again, glitch. And I get it, I get it, this is for PC only, but the videos in the past have worked for both PC and console, to be quite fair. It's just today we're going in a different direction. With this mod, you're going to be able to remove every door. And I highly recommend that you endorse this mod and, you know, maybe give this guy a comment over on the Nexus page, which I will leave a link down below and you can check that out for yourself. I'm just going to show you a quick guide on how to install this if you are on PC. The most important thing about this mod is that if you're going to use this, especially if you're new to the game, is that one, yeah, there could be a possibility ban, but that's not at least my main concern i guess which is kind of odd right but my, i guess the main concern here is you could possibly break some of the quest and that is not what you want to do with this so if you've not completed any of the quests that have grids on them or have any you know some stuff like that then you know just don't do it because otherwise you're going to probably break a quest and then you're going to ruin that character and there's no way you're going to be able to go back so what we want to do is we want to go to our folder here and we want to locate the fallout 76 we're going to go to the data and then once we clicked on this, we're going to locate the RNR file that we just downloaded from Nexus page, which is a complete clean file in a BA2. And we want to then transfer this on over to the data folder. Once you've done this, the next step is to go into your documents folder and locate your Fallout 76. But first you'll want to copy this right here that this modder has left in the description. We then want to go to the documents folder, locate that Fallout 76 folder. Then we want to go to our Fallout 76 custom here, and we want to click on this. You're going to see the text right here, but you just want to paste what we just copied down below, just like so. Then from there, you're good to go. You want to want blah, 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 blah. You'll want to launch. You'll want to launch this normally, like you would, and then uh, just simply load into any server. As for video purposes, I'm just gonna throw in a random location instead of the nuke silo like before. But yeah, this works for any type of grid. This will probably, I'm assuming, work for some camp objects out there, like the grid door before. I don't know. So. It's up to you guys to let me know if it does work that way. If it does, cool. If not, who cares? But I just wanted to share some of this information. All credit to the modder. Make sure you go down there, click that link down below, endorse it if you want, comment some good stuff, and heck, even try out the mod for yourself. Without all being said, I hope you guys are living a great life out there. I'm trying my best out here, and I hope to see you guys on the next video. Peace.